shocker as Nnamdi Kano speaks of Tunubu's chances of winning the election. <laughs> um, my dear listeners, um, you see, what has just been revealed in this very content um, is like a bomb. Yes, I called it a bomb because some persons will not believe that this is actually coming directly from Namde Kanu. I'm telling you, but you'll be surprised that truly it came from Namde Kanu. In fact, it was reviewed by his senior lawyer. Do you understand? So, um, I when while going through the content, I asked myself this question: What has happened? Why did Namde Kanu say this? Is he now showing interest for um, Nigerian presidency? Not until when I now go down and saw why he said what he said, according to his lawyer. It's actually for the good of the BR France anyway. Let's share the content. This is Evening News. What a shocking response. As Nnam Kano speaks of Tunubu's quest to become president of Nigeria, according to the IPOP leader who has been in detention for months now, he said becoming president of Nigeria is not a question of focusing on one region. The Southeast is a region of its own. We have other regions, and these regions will still have a candidate of their own. Focusing on the Southeast is one thing that I cannot assure you because Southeast already doesn't have anything to do with presidency aside from those traitors. Namde Kano have said through his media that every Piafran should go out and get his own PDC. This is for the record of facts to make Nigerian government to understand our plight and reason for agitation for Biafran freedom. The pursuit for Biafran freedom is not for violence, but for peacemaking. Biafran Republic will also have a leader, and so we need to start practicing that very act before it is actualized. Calling on the faithful, Nnamdi Kanu said that nothing is going to prevent any Biafrans from taking part or participating in the voting of a president in Nigeria. He said that it is a franchise of every citizen, pending when the actualization of Biafran is declared. We are on the move to get this done and also to get it actualized but then we all still need to exercise that very right because we are still in nigeria thank you so much Namde Kanu. you see that's why i said that you you you, you are just too different from other um agitators you know we have other group group agitating for Biafra. We have BZE, we have BNL, we have uh, uh, MASOP and what have you. But this very group, IPOP, their method of actualization is uh, agitation is just too different. Some persons say said that uh, they are violent in nature. No, they are not. Why they are criticizing them is that it is their voice that is mostly heard in the pursuit for Biafran freedom. And you know, as their voices are mostly heard, the, the people see reason to give them support. Okay, look at the countries, the countries where we have Biafra, uh, uh, IPOP. IPOP group, 
I, where we have the IPOP group, which of these countries in Nigeria that is not having IPOP as a group agitating for Biafra is everywhere. And because they are large in number, that is why their voice is still very much on high than any other group. Do you understand? So the government are bittered and very angry with this group because of their eye tune and also their popularity. You see that? So the fear is in them. But then the method of agitation is still very much uh, in uh, is still very much in a uh, in, 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 in a peaceful way. The, 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 the agitation for Biafran freedom is done in a very peaceful way. It's, the, it's done in a very peaceful method. Do you understand? And that is why you see that countries see reason to give them support and get them endorsed. If they are, they are, they are a powerless group, which, why, why won't this country, why would these, these countries want to endorse them? Why would this country want to support them? Why would this country want to support them financially? And what have you? That is what we should look into. So, my dear listeners, I'm very proud of this very decision made by Onyen Dumazin and the Kano. All Biafrans, look, you are a Biafran. You are still pursuing your struggle for Biafran freedom. But for to give them that benefit of doubt, get your PVC. That is why I appreciate the Igbo's the Igbo traders in Lagos who lock up their shops and went to get their PVC, their PVC, to exercise their franchise. You understand? That's why I appreciate them. That's why I appreciate them. So if you're a Biafran, do the same. That will not deny you of your of, of your of your republic. Just as Nam Kano had just said, it is a way of showing to them that you are for peace and not for violence. You understand? All right, let me hear you speak, my dear listeners, on this very fact. To know what you think and what you feel about this, don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload. Any